Welcome back to Wolfrin's Adventures. Uh, last chapter. Uh, Wolfrin made it through this uh, Skyrim temple. Which which was his uh, biggest challenge, perhaps. Well, actually, I'm not so sure. The dragon, the last dragon was pretty big. But the biggest one is yet to come. It's right down here. Right down here, the red dragon is supposed to be terrorizing the, the lands. So, we'll see. The, the, the old dragon slayer said that uh, this would be the by far the worst dragon I have to, uh, had to, um, to fight. Um, I should use caution when approaching this beast. This is more powerful than the three dragons I've fight before. Um, oh, I need an. Need my helmet. Yeah. So let's see how many. Oh, I have fire shield. That will probably be useful. Resist magic. Um, yeah. Maybe I'll use this one. And the fire, and I'll, I'll save the resist magic strong for the the fifth dragon, the last dragon. But yeah, this is going to be uh, this chapter is going to be the dragon fight, second but last, perhaps the best fight. Perhaps, perhaps it is going to be the best dragon fight because I always felt that red dragons, that's the that's a real beast. Um. I'm going the right way now. Yep. It should be dead ahead. Uh, let me just check if I've charged my weapon. 100 uses. Yes, it's fully charged. Oh, well, this one. Hmm. Nah. Uh, I think I'll just rely on my spells and uh, uh, and then keep this uh, shield up to reflect damage, reflect spells. It's such an overpowered shield. Where is it? Oh, I see it. I see it. There it is. Wow, that's just one leg. It's massive. It's the back is towards me. Um, I should use my, um, wow, my spell effective effectiveness is really low. <clears throat> mm, well, I have to use these anyway. I wonder if these are affected by, let me see, shield. Uh, world. No, I do seem to get full um, full effect. 30. Maybe greater powers and lesser powers are not affected by spell effectiveness. Right, now we got the... Now we got the damage, reflect damage, fortify health. Now we got another stack of fortify health. And that's it, I think. Uh, maybe I'll use some shock against it. What? Wow. Wow. Took me. Wow! Took half my health. Uh, I think it jumped on me. so difficult to hit it. Almost dead. Heal. Um. Uh, oh, I forgot. I forgot. Fire shield. 
Wow, I'm going through my prison. I can't hit it. I was almost dead. I can't cast my spells. Like every time I try to cast a spell, I hit it. It throws me to the ground. Wow! I got it. Fame. I got a fame point. Wow. There it is. Look at the size of the head. <laughs> I did it. Yeah, it was. It was the toughest. I went through f was it three or four of the strongest health potions. Really quickly. I have eight left of normal potions. Whew, that was good. That was a good fight. Wow, it's. It's all the way down here. Yeah, that's a good point. It's a good idea that it uh, provides a fame point. Now, when when I walk into a uh, Chaden Hall, I tell them, they will be like, "Wow, look at that guy, Grand Soul Gem." Yeah, I'm taking all of these. Um, I better save. <laughs> that was a good fight. So now, Wolfrin has one, one uh, dragon left. Wow, this will be uh, this will be um, like a tourist attraction. Immediately, when I go into the town, everyone wants to come out and uh, and see the dragon. They're all gonna. Gonna want to see it. What's that? Is that an enemy? He's looks like he's he might be an enemy. Yeah, you attack me with this bandit bowman. Uh, smoke pork sausage. I'll take that. Wolf, wolf friend's hungry, I think. Uh, oh, I didn't even use any of this. Well, I think my the resist magic potion was probably a good choice. Even though the stomping, when it just jumps on you. That takes like half your health, and that's, uh, I don't think that's magic damage, I think that's, uh, yeah, non-magical, physical damage. <laughs> it could have been just a bit longer, but uh, the fight, but uh, it was still, it was still pretty epic. I kept being thrown to the ground. By the sheer force of the, the fireball. Oh, here we are. At the lake outside of Cheaton Hall. Yeah. 
Yeah, the beautiful city of Chino. Um, I what actually? I'm trying to work out um, what the plan was. I don't. In, I don't actually think I had a plan after this. This was my big plan that I wanted to um, go through the Skyrim temple here, and it happened to fit really well with the dragon fight. So now um, I don't actually have something that I need to do. So I'll just I'll just relax a bit and see what happens. That's a good thing about Oblivion because it's a it's an open open world game. Uh, you don't need a it's a small fireplace over here, a small camp maybe. You don't need to have to be constantly be on a quest. You can just walk around and do whatever you like. It's really nice. Actually, I almost never get fame points. It's a. Uh, I think it's because I tend to not do any of the quests. I just I always invent my own quests and missions I want to go on, and and then I never do the sort of the the official quests. Uh oh, what's happened here? Looks like a graphical bug. I have to fix that. Um, but I never, um, I never fix. Uh, I never. Um, or I rarely, I rarely go to these um, these um, official quest that grants you fame points. So I guess I'll. Maybe I should do that some more if I want fame, <laughs> because it's pretty hard to come by if you don't do the quests. I really like this uh, unique landscapes, it, what it does here around uh, Chatenhall. Well, let's go inside. Uh, it looks like it's midday. Yeah, it's midday, 3.30. Let me just save. 